What's good YouTube, it's your boy Jeter Don and welcome back to another YouTube video. Now today, I'm gonna be using a Scizor rental team. Uh, Scizor, been a staple of VGC, cool guy, got to wear red to support. He's been one of the best mods for forever. It's kind of falling off, but it's Scarlet and Violet, Regulation D, all these new mods coming back. I think there's a chance we can make them work. Now as you can see with the team, we got the annoying, the consistent Don Dozo Tatsugiri combo. You guys already know what that does. It's just dumb, it's OP, but got, gotta bring it, gotta use it. Berserker, he's actually here to help out Scizor. Uh, that ability, Steely Spirit, is gonna go crazy with uh, Bullet Punch. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know why Sword Stance is on this Scizor. It has a choice band. I'm guessing maybe if it gets tricked, this is not my team, it's another rental. If you wanna see where it's from, check out, or use it, check out the description, it's gonna be down there. While you're down there, leave a like and subscribe, why not, come on. Uh, we all know Chen Pao, he's just gonna also boost that damage. My man Iron Hands, the big ball of stats, he's here to fake out and just apply crazy amounts of damage. I'm gonna see you guys in game number one. You guys found an opponent for game number one, and it is Fred Ben, rank 15,000. Now, his rank does look trash, but I do need to remind you guys, I am also what they would call a scrub at this game. So, Ooh, but this team, I do honestly see lead where it's just Chien Pao and Scizor. I can take down any sort of terrain. Actually, let's not lead Scizor. That bullet punch is just going to do nothing that first turn. So let's lead... Let's go Chien Pao, Don Dozo. I believe this is always going to be a great lead for this team. And then just bring Tatsugiri and Scizor in the back. Um... The only thing that really does scare me on this team, I guess there's, there's two. It's gonna be Iron Bundle and Chiyu. They're very annoying, crazy special attack, and Don Dunzo really can't do anything against it. No one on this team can really take those hits. Lando does scare me as well a little bit, but the double genie is kind of a crazy play for them. We'll see how that goes, though. I'll see you guys once we actually see the opponent's leads. Hopefully nothing too crazy, something I can handle, because I don't want to go on a lost streak. All right, it's game. Opponent's leading off with Thunderous and Indeedy. Okay, that's exactly why I did not bring, uh, what's his name in the beginning. Now, do they go for Wilbort Storm? That's the question. I don't see a reason as to why not just go Ice Spinner. Hope it, they let me hit the Thunderous. And uh, why not just go for an order up on? Let's go thunderous again. I don't really see a reason why they wouldn't just hit follow me. If they don't, I'll take the free KO. I don't want Paris spam all over the field. It is the most annoying thing. Let's see what. Do they sub out in DD? That was the question. Because no matter, if someone's taking this double hit, I believe they're going down no matter what. But, Withdraw Thunderous. I'm hoping it's not something that can take these hits. Don't know what the hell that is. Iron Bundle. I hope they did not hit follow me. I think I can. I think I could knock it out if they let me. Is it be enough power? Not very effective there. Psychic, don't care for that's not doing anything. Oh, that did more than I thought, actually. We're up. Not as much as I'd hoped. Um. Okay. Still didn't take any damage, though, on Chien Pao, which is fine. Because I'm gonna go for a. S Ooh, not a Sucker Punch. I'm gonna go for a Sucker Punch on you. And I believe the play here would just be another order up of you as well. Uh, if you protect, oh well. Don't really care for Ndidi right now. Least of my problems. The utter least. Now I'm hoping, best case scenario, they just go for a freeze try. <laughs> With Drew and Didi, glad I'm not attacking you. Sentai you that is a little scary. But not too scary. Sucker punch. Ooh. Okay. We can do that. We take those. And then order up. How much is this gonna do? Not enough. 
I, I wish I'd gone for Wave Crash there. That actually would have been a great amount of damage, but oh well. Now the do I just keep running Ice Spinner on everything? I don't see a reason as why not to. This opponent really hasn't given me a reason not to. I also don't think they have anything else in the back that's just going to be able to take on Ice Spinners all game. Indeedy, who cares? Yeah, and then Thunders is going to be weak to Ice Spinner. So, I believe Ice Spinnering and just Wave Crashing everything will be the play from now on. Sent out Indeedy. Gonna take out that Psychic Terrain. Now the question is, does Ndidi have Rocky Helmet? That one does scare me. I'm not 100% sure. I'm gonna attack the Ndidi anyways, and... Uh, I believe I'm going down anyway, so why not go for the Earthquake? If I take myself out, oh well. If I don't, this would be nice. They're gonna go for Terra Water, probably. Okay, whatever. Mm. Ice Spinner yet again. Please don't be Rocky Helmet. It is. Okay, that's fine, because Chi was gonna go down regardless, so I will just take the free earthquakes that I'm gonna put down. Or not, they were gonna let me survive. Wow. Uh, okay, that's actually mighty fine. That is mighty fine now. Now I just bring in Scizor. Chi Yu is going to have to protect, and there is absolutely nothing that this Ndidi can do to me. Not a damn thing. So we're going to start off probably, I'm hoping, 1 0. Oh. Um, this team is not that scary anymore. Let's go for another Ice Spinner. Ooh. Yeah, I spin her bullet punch. If I, if I do die here though, this is not good. Follow me. I'm hopefully bullet punch. I'm hoping can get it. Hope. I'm hoping. Please get that KO. Okay. Now this is not going to do too much damage. Oh, this, this is not actually good spot at all. I might have just sold myself. Uh, I spinner's not going to do enough. Not enough. Oh, that sucks. Just not enough. Someone survive. Crudon champ out here, not matter who's going down. Oh no. Oh no. It all comes down to the Dragon Boy. Mmm. I do not like this spot. Uh. Now, Icy Wind. Definitely can do something to Thunderous and kill to you, I hope. But if they just go for Para Spam, I am kind of done. They do need to go for attacks here, though. And I think I'm the fastest thing on the field. Here, oh, that sucks. That, yeah, that just killed. That nerfed the hell out of me. Uh, and it doesn't get the Chi Yu pickup. No. Oh man, that's a tough way to go, game one. Oh, that sucks. Good game by the opponent, though. I mean, they played that beautifully. I thought I had it, honestly. Sucks. But 0 and 1, let's hope not to go 0 and 2. If we go 0 and 2, I'm just shutting off the cam. I know that I can't, I can't use this team if that's the case. Ugh. Thought I could do good with the boy Scissor today. Not looking too hot. But I'll see you guys in game number two. Hopefully I don't let you down. I can go one on one. And then hopefully you end up in a two on one situation. Alright guys, found an opponent for game number two. And as you can see, our rank is dropping. So we need this top 7,000 win. To hopefully get it back out of the 10Ks. Now this is a game where I do believe... This is going to be risky, very risky, but I'm going to go Iron Hands Chen Pao to lead off with this team. And then in the Brack, I'm going to bring Scizor and Berserker. Now this team is this team's going to be very weak to ground moves, and they do have some ground, some fall. They have a good mixture of stuff, but I believe in the long run that 
Dozo and Tatsugiri are not going to do much for me here. I mean, they could help against that Urshifu, yet I don't know if it's Wicked Blow or Single Strike form. If you know, you are somehow a nerd, but they I don't see too much damage being given off besides Lando to any of these, these guys, so... Lando, if we can knock him off the field, would be nice. Would be nice. He's the scariest guy out here. Now let's see what they're going to lead off with. I'm hoping... I'm, I know they're going to come out with Rillaboom, just to apply Freak out off first. Mm. Okay. They're definitely you turning out of here. And faking out. They might fake out Chen Pao in U turn. Believe is what they'd go for here. Um. What is. Boosted. Okay. That's something I don't see ever. Now. For me, I believe if they fake out Chen Pao, I fake out uh, Lando. And I'm gonna just. Ice Spinner. Oh, uh, Rillaboom. He's the scariest. Iron Hands gets the fake out on Lando. Okay, that's actually very nice. Okay, that's that's a lot better than I thought it was going to be for a lead. What do you do here is the question. Knock off. Okay, that does not matter. Does not matter. Now, the play is what do they bring in? behind the Lando, or do they keep the Lando? I'm gonna go for a Drain Punch on whatever's back there. Now I could just straight up Ice Spinner Lando, to be honest. He is the scarier threat. If they protect, I'm screwed, but... You could also Terra, and I could... Mm, let's see what they got. Nothing? Okay. Do I get a KO here with this Drain Punch? I don't believe so. U-turn aisle. Okay, I survived. That is actually very good. That is very good. Anything else that comes in, I can just Sacred Sword. Or not Sacred Sword, Sucker Punch. Unless they bring in... The only guy I'd really be scared of right now would be that, uh... Name. Not that. I'm not scared of that. Drain Punch. Oh, that's the Dark Virgin. Not even gonna, what, and a crit, baby? Yeah, that's a taste of their own medicine. That's a taste of their own medicine. Now, this is a great game, but the problem is I'm not getting to use Scizor, which does suck, but. Now, I swear if they lag out, I'm gonna be pissed. If that's a straight quit, I'm fine. Come on, don't do me dirty, game. Don't do me dirty. This game loves to lag me out. I swear to God, I don't know what it is. Mmm, please be a win. Please be a win. Please go as a win. Make take some time for results to be continue battling. Okay, counter as a win. Cool. Shout out to the opponent for quitting. Your boys one and one. Back out of the top the 10k numbers. I'm, those numbers look so bad. Uh found an opponent for game number three. Final game and hopefully a win. Top 4k. Okay. Now the question is. Ooh, this is a little bit of a scary team. I think I do run the same leads here, though. I don't see an issue with it. Corviknight probably is the scariest thing that they could bring. Like, Dragapult, yeah, he's scary, but uh, I can deal with him. Rillaboom is really the only thing I'd be afraid of on this team. Just that fake-out pressure. That's why I'm not going to leave Berserker and... Uh, what is Scizor? But, man, this Scizor gameplay turned out to not do anything with Scizor. He he got smoked game one, didn't even need to come out game two. Is he going to do something game three? Show me what he's about, man. But, I don't think so. I'll see you guys with, when they lead off with... Uh, I'll see you guys with what they lead off in game three. Alright, guys. My opponent will be leading off with, hopefully, anything but Rillaboom. And it is Reggie Lefkin. God damn it. Uh, now, do I just... I do, am I really afraid of Rillaboom? 
I think the play here is really just a drain punch. In all honestly, on Reggie Alecki. You can try to slow me down. Uh, I'll go for an ice spinner on the boom. Ooh, okay, good play by the opponent. Thunder Cage, I don't know what that is, to be honest. Leaves me alive, that's what that does. But I'm trapped in. Don't really care that I'm trapped in here. Yeah, don't care at all. That's a nice KO. Now, I believe... What did they bring in, though? It's not really a great position for them to be in. Because I can just drain... Oh, I did not know that did that. Uh, but I think I'm going to go Drain Punch and Sucker Punch. Drain Punch and Sucker Punch on... Ooh, do I want a Sucker, though? Do I want a Sucker? They send out their own chin, though. Uh, I'm going to go for a Drain Punch. Or I could go for an Earthquake. Um, yeah, I think that's what I want to go with. I want to go Earthquake Sucker. I don't see a reason as to why not. Don't see a reason as to why not. Earthquake sucker on Reggie. Because I, I just see the Chin Pao being... Oh, they withdrew. Oh, do not be a flying type, please. That's fine. Yeah, I killed my own guy, but... I can I can handle this. Okay. Gonna go... I'm gonna guess Dragon. Cool. Not really worried about it. Not really worried about it. That's why I did not drain punch. I was very, very glad I did not drain punch. I did not know you could sucker punch a sucker punch, though. What the hell? I'm not killing my own, then. That's fine with me. Earthquake should do some solid damage to Chien Pao. Almost stopped it. Half on Dragon Ball. Um. Do I have Protect? I do not. I believe the play here is an all honestly. I'm gonna go wild charge onto Chien Pao. You're not the most bulky thing out there. And then just go for bullet punches on Dragon Ball. Hopefully get the KOs. Uh, these dragon darts or phantom forces and sucker punches are gonna suck. Yeah, that, that does a good amount. Bullet punch, come on! Ooh, that's huge, that is huge. That is huge. Uh, Reggie Alecki, I believe, will have issues here. Don't know... I I don't see any other option for my opponent but to quit. There's no point in bringing Reggie Alecki. Your boy's 2-1 and one on the day after the first video. Uh, uh, after the first game, not looking too hot, but... I mean, what I can say about this team... Not much for Scizor. Uh, I didn't think I'd see this many counters, to be honest to him. But Chiyu, yes, is everywhere. Kind of forgot about him, to be honest. But for Rigorath, who definitely I've been seeing more and more popping up all over the place. Insane counter. Ndidi, the usual counter. So there is a good amount of things to kind of hold this back. Um, I didn't even get to use Berserker, who you would mainly want to pair him up with. Chi or Chien Pao though, did get a lot of use out of him. Mostly with Iron Hands though. So if I were to rank this team genuinely on a one to 10, I'm giving it like a four or a five. Uh, yeah, I went positive with this team. I do believe though, any other team would have got me this far, and this positive. Hey, top, top 7K though, can't complain. Uh, but thank you guys for coming to watch this video. Uh, if you made it all the way through, why not leave a like, comment, and or, not and or, just and subscribe too. Come on, man, you made it to the end. You probably gonna watch another video, which should be popped up down there too as well. So thank you guys for coming. See you in the next video. Peace.